as you behold, listen, as you behold the goodness of the Holy Ghost, which Holy is his glory, you will be changed today. from one thing to the next thing. Holy we are Ghost marching toward singularity. The Holy Ghost is God the in the earth today. And you walk with him by right saying words. Hand. My name is Andrew Hemstrott. Thank you for joining us. First Corinthians chapter 12 and verse 11. But all these worketh that one. Say that one. That one. That one and self same spirit. So he's one and he's a self yep. that one and self same spirit and who would this be talking about the holy, ghost. the holy ghost dividing to every man severally as he will so we know he's one mm -hmm. say he's one he's one he's a self, he's a self. and he does things as he will mm -hmm. are you here so he has a will yep because he's a person he has a will right yeah. and before this we had a whole bunch of things gifts of the spirit the word of wisdom the word of knowledge discerning of spirits faith all of these things right working of miracles who's the one that works all these things Jesus. first Corinthians chapter 12 verse 7 but the manifestation of the spirit is given mm -hmm. so we have this one Stay with me this is gonna be important we have this one being who is a spirit he's a spirit being called the Holy Ghost and it says the manifestation is given so we have this one being Holy Ghost in the earth giving manifestations to every man to profit with all so who's the one giving the manifestations to the everyman? Yeah, Holy, Ghost. Holy Ghost. Say, I'm an everyman. I'm an everyman. So as you increase in your relationship with him, you should be increasing in the manifestations that he gives to you. Does this make sense? And those manifestations would include all these things that he works. Say, all the things, all the things. That, he works. that he works. And those things that he works are all the things. Amen. Say, he worketh, he worketh all, the things. all the things. And we're talking about the Holy Ghost. In fact, if you read chapter 12, verse 1, he says, Now concerning spiritual, it says gifts here in the King James, but it really means spiritual things, mm -hmm. brethren. I don't want you to be ignorant. Mm -hmm. So things pertaining to this spirit, mm -hmm. this one, this one being, Holy Ghost he doesn't want you to be ignorant how many people are ignorant many many people are ignorant of this one yes. in that he has all the things and he gives all the things say he gives, he gives. All, the things. all the things and there is a new manifestation of the Spirit coming I hope you can hear that and it happens to be in the only of God the Holy Ghost mm -hmm. say the only, the only of, God, the of God the Holy Ghost and I will be explaining that a little more as we go on but Jesus said Luke chapter 4 verse 8 it is written thou shalt worship they worship. worship worship the Lord thy God and him only serve mm -hmm. Is that in your Bible mm -hmm. who said it Jesus mm -hmm. thou shalt worship the Lord thy God mm -hmm. who's the Lord thy God Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost in the earth today John chapter 4 verse 24 says God is a spirit and they that worship him so thou shalt worship the Lord thy God and the end and. Him, him only. only is there an only there yep. yeah. if you don't do the worship part 
you will never get to the only serve part mm -hmm. and do we know what and means mm -hmm. yeah. yeah and so I worship the Lord my God and him only do I serve I'll never get to the only mm -hmm. until I do the worship part and there have been entire books written about the Holy Ghost and yet they fail to mention worshiping him they'll never get to the only what am I talking about I'm talking about the only we're going to expand what the only means mm -hmm. is this okay mm -hmm. yes. so these entire books written about the Holy Ghost who fail to mention to worship him boo disqualified mm -hmm. from only they'll never get here because only is where we're going now stay hooked up because that's where we're going <laughs> we have a place to go mm -hmm. so you're worshiping the Lord your God and him only serving everything must be in there mm -hmm. everything must be in the worship of the Lord your God and him only serving yeah. 2nd Corinthians chapter 3 verse 17 now the Lord is that spirit what spirit the Holy Ghost the Holy Spirit and where the Spirit Lord is literally that's what it says where the Spirit Lord is there is Liberty or freedom verse 18 but we all with open face beholding as in a glass the glory of the Lord say the glory, the glory. of the Lord the glory of what Lord Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost this one we are talking about we're beholding him his glory and are changed into the same image a different image no, the, same. the same image from glory to glory even as by the Spirit of the Lord other translations say even as by him the Spirit Lord yeah. we're changed by beholding him and by beholding his glory and the image as you look at him and as you behold him and his glory that image changes to you because you can see more of who he is and so your image of the Holy Ghost changes say my image, my image of, the of the Holy Ghost changes so here we can see there's only one way to go from glory to glory it's by the Spirit Lord worshiping him and serving him only are you getting this mm -hmm. and we're changed into the same image now remember we started out this he is one mm -hmm. one spirit mm -hmm. right first Corinthians 12 verse 11 all these worketh that one and self same spirit as he wills so we're beholding him and we're being changed into this one image say one image, one image. oneness say oneness. oneness that's like only isn't it mm -hmm. you can say one you could say only mm -hmm. changed into the same yeah. the same means the one mm -hmm. the image mm -hmm. only and your view of him changes and therefore you change likewise say I change, I change. Likewise. likewise can you see that he's one can you see that he does all things he has all things and does all things he is the singularity now the definition of singularity Webster's is the quality or condition of being singular he is the only God in the earth today and when we behold him we are changed into the only that he has and the only that he is are you here mm -hmm. this is gonna be important now a scientific example you all right with us a scientific example of singularity would be a black hole have you heard of that mm -hmm. it's a hole that's black mm -hmm. now it's it's a space 
anomaly where gravity has become so great from a star that all matter is compressed into a single point say a single point, a single point. now the Holy Ghost being the singularity all things are compressed into him mm -hmm. are you here mm -hmm. we go from glory to glory by beholding him all things mm -hmm. he does all things he has all things we're beholding him are you getting this all matter compressed into a single point talking about a black hole and beyond the event horizon meaning you get too close to the event horizon of this black hole and there is no return light doesn't escape it becomes part listen it becomes part of the singularity say it becomes, it becomes part, part of the singularity. singularity and there's no return and I read this from a scientific paper singularities cause the laws of physics to break down and respond in ways that are not natural they really don't know what's going on inside that black hole but I bet you would if you went past the event horizon <laughs> you would know what's going on so trying to draw a correlation here there is a singularity at the center of every verse of Scripture who would be if you dug down into that verse of Scripture who would be in there the Holy Ghost because he spoke it yeah. so there is a singularity at the center of every verse of Scripture and when you begin to behold him you begin to see him in that verse of Scripture and you are changed into it are you here mm -hmm. I'm preaching from the room of Holy Ghost worship you see things in here that you didn't see out there before does this make sense mm -hmm things you thought you knew those laws break down in here things function differently Ezekiel chapter 1 and verse 16 the appearance of the wheels say the wheels, wheels. and their work was like the color of burl and they four had one likeness and their appearance and their work were as it were a wheel in the middle of the wheel or other translations say a wheel within a wheel mm -hmm. say a wheel, a wheel. Within, a wheel. within a wheel now does this sound normal this sounds like it's on a different level doesn't it mm -hmm. in fact he had a difficulty describing what was going on here mm -hmm. you've been preoccupied with the outer wheels and I need the outer wheel to turn that I might have more money I need the outer wheel to turn that I may be healed I need the outer wheel to turn that I may have my youth renewed we're preoccupied with the outer wheel and yet one notch of movement from the inner wheel is life-changing but you haven't been using it you just gotta listen with the ears of your spirit we are marching toward singularity or for my UK listeners we are marching towards singularity oneness with the Holy Ghost say oneness, oneness. With, the Holy Ghost. with the Holy Ghost he is the singularity he does all things are you here we, this is how we started out he is the singularity he's the one we are beholding we are being changed from glory to glory beholding his glory he is the singularity we are marching towards singularity and speaking his word becomes worship do you remember the centurion with Jesus he said speak the word only and my servant shall be healed speaking the word only results in singularity results in I worship you Holy Ghost only speaking his word becomes worship 
speaking the word only results in I worship you Holy Ghost only singularity marching toward singularity no one has ever approached singularity Enoch maybe Hebrews chapter 11 verse 5 by faith Enoch was translated that he should not see death and was not found because God had translated him for before say before, before before his translation he had something he had a testimony he had something he said that pleased God so we know he was saying things that pleased God no one has ever approached a singularity the point of crossing over the event horizon in black hole speak Enoch maybe but we are changed into his image singular from glory to glory whose image are you changed into Holy Ghost he is one he does all things we are changed into his image we use his words and are changed into the image of the glory in those words are you getting this mm -hmm. Exodus chapter 33 when we see Moses here talking to God and he said in verse 18 he said I beseech thee show me thy glory remember this and in verse 19 he said I will make all my goodness pass before thee so all of God's goodness is his glory and all of God's goodness compressed into one is the singularity I hope you're starting to see this your view of the Holy Ghost should be changing all his goodness compressed into one is the singularity I worship you Holy Ghost only I am preaching the singularity can you start to see the only mm -hmm. can you start to see how everything is in the only in the only is everything it's the singularity does the Holy Ghost have everything mm -hmm. remember how we began this he worketh all these things and he giveth it to those who worship him right yes. if he has all things and he is one he is the singularity of all the things yeah. first Timothy chapter 6 verse 17 charge them that are rich in this world that they be not high-minded nor trust in uncertain riches but trust in the living God. living God and who is the living God Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost who gives us richly all things to enjoy you being given richly all things to enjoy is glorious are you here you're beholding you're worshiping the living God he has all things and he gives all things richly all things is all things he can't give all things if he doesn't have all things mm -hmm. he is the singularity mm -hmm. and all these worketh that one mm -hmm. I wish that these things would worketh in me they will he gives them to you you are changed from glory to glory Moses said show me your glory he said I'll show you all my goodness I'll let my goodness pass before you that is his glory and as you behold listen as you behold the goodness of the Holy Ghost which is his glory you will be changed from one thing to the next thing we are marching toward singularity Holy Ghost I thank you 
that people heard this word this evening and new understanding has taken place on the inside of them yes they might not know it all right now but as they pursue you and keep walking towards you the glory will become greater and stronger and they will see it and they will understand and we give you Holy Ghost all the glory and the praise in Jesus name amen, amen. if you have a tithe or an offering hold it in your hand say this after me Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost I God, worship God, you I thank you that you are multiplying my tithes and offerings and they are increasing in the earth coming to me and I shall be glorified in those by you in Jesus name amen